See how you are reducing yourself for nothing. For what? Eh? It's yourself. I beg you in the name of my late father. Let me be. Please. Shama, I won't let you be. I won't let you be. Jump into the car. And let us go and... And have sex. Family will never remain the same again. Forever! Chiozala, it looks to me like you are the one. You are the one behind all my family has been going through from day one. Just to frustrate me into sleeping with you. Okay? God forbid. Why would you think that? Why? In other words, you are only but a wicked man. A wicked man who is exploiting his late friend's tragedy and that of his family just to achieve his sexual desires. Choma, 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 you are taking this out of context. Yes. What do you want from me? As always, sex. Sex. Eh? <laughs> Listen. If you are now ready, my car is free. Come on, come on. Hmm? <laughs> Where do you want it? In your car or in your house? Achoma, you know I am a titled man. We should go to my house. <laughs> it's beautiful, hmm? <laughs> Good. I'd love to kiss your hand too. Oh, really? Okay. Ah! Oh! Hey! Hey! It's just the next time you try this process with me, it will not be your fingers I will bite, but I will chop off your mouth with you. Yes! I will chop off your mouth with you. Yes! Hey! Stinking old man like you! Oh, please, I'll have a word with you! You're wicked! Oh, come on! 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 My father will not pay you. You know my father. He will not pay you. I will do it very well. You don't have to worry. So, how much is good for you to do the job? A any amount you, you think is good enough, it's okay by me. What manner of uh, 
bargaining is that? Can't you mention any amount? Well, I haven't done this type of work in somebody's farm before. So, I don't even know what to bargain or how to bargain it. Okay, okay, okay. You know what? Once you are done with the job, I will tell my father to pay you 3,000 naira. Deal? If it's okay by you, it's fine. Did I say something wrong? No, 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 no. As soon as you start the job, come to me for your morning, afternoon, and evening meal. And as soon as you finish this one, remember the first portion of land I showed you? Of the land. Yes. Thank you. Mama, like we discussed earlier, you will do the selling alone. If you do not trust the buyer and the money you were given, people, you're somebody. Beg somebody to help you identify the money. You know, I will be off to Papu Bioma's farm now to start the weeding and cultivation job that I got. And I will be back later in the day to take you home. You know, go. Oh, good evening. Almost. Welcome. Oh, now, 100 naira. I take my no, 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 wait. Yeah. Are you sure this is 100 naira? Yes, my 100 naira. Are you sure? Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. Give me some cassava to use as my meals for the two days I'll be working in their farm. Hey! Feel it. Make us a Hey! Fat, fat cassava. Hey! Feel it. Abu Kay, Mecca. Yes! Hey! If you call Hey! Mama, guess what I want to do with them? I want to process it into Gary. Hey, Gary? <laughs> Yes. I, I think I have a better idea. Tapioca. Tapioca. Yes, guys, Abacha. Nyano, it can easily be sold. Eh? And we'll make money out of it. If we do that, what are we then going to eat? Tapioca too? Yes, Choma. Tapioca is good food. I think with that idea of tapioca, we'll make it sell and make more money, buy more cassava, buy foodstuffs and make savings. The broom business is still there. 
Nobody is touching it. Hmm? What do you think, my daughter? It's a good idea. Yeah. I like it. <laughs> Let me drink water and eat right. Mm -hmm. Then I'll come back and begin to clean it. Let me show back, show back. Yeah. Bring some more. Let me help you. Yes, Mama. Eh? Yeah. I go to the Oh, you are young one. Oh, you are young one. Your sister is trying, no? Hmm? She's struggling. We'll soon come out. And it's too small. small. Yeah, it's small. I'll, I'll give you three of this for 200. Okay. Let's just manage it. Okay. Yeah. Please, I don't have my own. Don't be angry. Don't worry. What of your mom? She's fine. She's at home. Hey, greet her. Greet her. Bye. annoying to kill you. I've had enough of surprises. Enough! Your Majesty, the prospect of them raising money needed to successfully defend Arinze's case is not there at all. To me, they are just surviving from it. To be defended at all. Anyhow, you look at it. Eyebrows will be raised by people the moment the location of the oil wells becomes public knowledge. People will suddenly realize that those oil wells were located in Enua and on those lands. If by then any soul from those two families still survives, another surprise might spring up from an unexpected source and then I might end up the ultimate loser. You want all of them dead? summary of it all is that his spirit was quite lifted on hearing our progress so far. Hey! Like us, 
he's swimming in hope. Hope that this whole crisis is coming to an end by God's grace. Oh, I can't wait to hold him in my arms as a free man. I know, Mama. You will. You hold him. Here. I bought snacks for you. The yeah. same place I bought for him. Yeah. Hey, that would be a change of diet for him. <laughs> That's true. Uh, let's share this one. Huh? I, can, hey, hey, yeah. I don't want mama eat all of it. I am too hungry for this. What I need is solid food. Hey. There is soup inside though. Yes. You can make it for yourself. Isn't your mother too? Huh? You are under arrest for deliberate food poisoning. Arrest her. Hey! Mama! Mama! Wait, wait! My mother is lying down on court shock. I want to defend her best. Arrest her!
That is Theodosia. Here. That is 500,000 naira in there. Sorry, Your Majesty. I... I... I mean, why, why, why would you invite me to your... Palace to give me such a huge amount of money. I don't know. We've never met before. Well, we're meeting now. And you're the richer for it by half a million naira. Isn't that something to be grateful for? Your Majesty, I am an apostle of the nothing goes for nothing philosophy. So, uh, why are you... I am paying you to back off a reason in the worst case. What? You volunteered to represent him in that case without a fee. And now, you have been paid a huge sum of money. Why, Your Majesty? You really want me to answer that? Um, yes, and um, it is only on that condition that I will do what you want me to do. Barrister, it does him. Is there anything you think a billionaire, first class, traditional ruler? who has paid you a huge sum of money to back off a case cannot do to have his way. I trust in my life, Your Majesty. <laughs> You're smart after all. Especially the Chiamas side of it. A 
as Dr. Sam called you to give an update on the mother's state of health in that health center. Yes. He called me before the barrister arrived and said that the woman has regained consciousness. Mm. She has? Yes. He said that her grief, after she has told what happened, has been overwhelming. And uh, since then, she has refused to talk to anyone or agreed to be talked to. Uh, she has buried him herself in her own grief and uh, been mourning endlessly. Your Majesty, do I administer a lethal injection as we planned? No. Now that she has uh, regained consciousness, um, nothing dramatic for now, remember. Um, we'll have to find another way of eliminating her pretty soon. For now, I am more interested in Osmond. Call the guy that's searching for him. I want to talk to him now. They took everything. I came back from the hospital and found the woman Chioma and I saved gone. On her feet. Nothing was left at all. Huh. Bravo. Bravo to the evil one. They finally won. No, don't talk like that, Sarisi. If we can never win a just war. Ours is not a just war, Mama. It's a war of treachery, of evil and death. There's nothing just about it. Now that it is obvious that a monstrous evil person somewhere was responsible for everything. What are you trying to say? I, I don't understand it. Choma was set up. The lady that sold the snack to her has disappeared. What? Not just that. The lawyer who volunteered to handle my case left me a while ago. He has dropped the case, Mama. And now you've lost all your money. It's over. Over my money, warm. Check and check. Check. What are you saying? Are you trying to. Mama, I'm trying to say nothing but bravo to the evil person that is responsible for all this. They've won. It's over, Mama. It's over. Can't you see the way we are suffering? Okay, okay. Lord, where are you? Oh, are you going to sit up there and keep quiet?
<laughs> Greetings from His Majesty, Pastor. <laughs> interested in the money as I am in, interested in Asmund's death. Do you hear me? Go ahead and kill him immediately, even if he does not talk about the money. Yes. It's all right. See, just go ahead and chop off his useless head, decapitate it, and then Get me video evidence. I will do exactly as you said. I hope you have uh, you have things uh, the tool necessary to use in Captain. Go ahead, do it, and bring the video evidence to me, and I will pay you handsomely. In fact, I'll pay you more than double. Thank you very much. for making my day. Hey, this is, this is what I call surveillance. This is what I call successful mission. Good. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> He told you to kill me. He said I should behead you. I'll record it on video. I'll bring it to him as evidence. Hey, please, please, don't do such a thing to me, please. I beg you, God's name. Please, don't kill me. I don't want to die. You know what? See, I still have four hundred fifty thousand dollars of His Majesty's money. Okay? Spare me. I promise I will share the money with you. I will share it with you fifty-fifty. Please. Too late, bro. His Majesty is more interested in your death than the money. And the man you are talking to is a co-professional. I am not interested in your offer. Boss, hmm? that's a huge amount we are talking about here. That's a huge money. See, we are talking about $450,000. Not, not $450,000. Huh? Think of what this money can do for you and your family now, please. Don't you me. Let me tell you something. His Majesty is a bloodthirsty madman. He will just wait like a common dog. Huh? He will not give any time of what he promised you. Look, let me tell you something. Hmm? I promise. I'll make you a millionaire instantly. If only. I said I'm not interested. Save your breath. You have a zero hour now. Please. Please. Don't kill me now. Please, I beg you. Don't kill me. I beg you. I don't want to die. Hey. 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 God. What are you doing? Wait and watch what I'm doing. Or what I'm about to do. Good.
exactly what I wanted. Exactly how I wanted it. Tomorrow I will go personally and see the state governor and ensure that he signs the death warrant in two weeks' time. Congratulations, Your Majesty. Not yet. Not yet, Stanley. Sit down. Chioma and her mother are still alive. Your man, Ken, is yet to confirm with a video evidence the death of Osmond. Six days after he called to say that he had him. And since then, his phone has been switched off. Your Majesty. I have told you not to worry about Ken. If there is anyone that I trust after myself, it's him. And I must tell you that Cain loves surprises more than anything. And I believe that he is at it again with this. I hate surprises. How many times will I tell you that? I will not believe. There is nothing that will make me believe. That Osman is dead until I see the video evidence. Period. In that case, I will go for him myself if after two days from today, if he did not show up with the evidence. Meanwhile, I want Ichio Zara and Ichio Deku permanently They know too much. Tomorrow, you will get them out of the way without any trace. I have paid Inspector Bussi to go to Chioma's cell and poison her. The same tomorrow, you will pay her mother a visit. Inform her. But then she will be grieving. Then you will kill her. Make it look like she died out of overwhelming grief. About time we cleaned the table. Then to the time to celebrate. Consider it done, Your Majesty. Consider them done.
Has her mother been informed? Oh yes. Corporal John was sent to go and inform her. And I made sure that there was no mention of poison in their report. She was found dead in her cell and she will be buried before nightfall as you instructed. Excellent. Very excellent. No. Igwe. In the chair of Ihube Kingdom. As the unknown of this kingdom, my opinion will naturally be guided by the customs and traditions of our land. On this issue, therefore, I stand with the ways of our ancestors. Thank you very much, Ono. You've spoken very well. Elders in Council. Um, I take it that this happens to be the last opinion from the elders in Council. Now, my judgment. I hereby align my judgment with that. Therefore, why be the symbol of authority of our kings? Belongs to the gods of Ihube. From whom our kings derive their legitimacy, powers, and the privileges. The gods asked me to come to the coven with it. When I shall return, only the gods know. But when that happens, what is hidden shall be revealed, and what is taken shall be restored. But until then, no matter what happens, do not consult any Dibia or a crop seer to know why. They will destroy whoever that tries that in an unimaginable way. Go and tell the web that sent you to me what I just said. Go! 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 Now listen, all of you. Outside, all of us here, apart from all of us here, I do not want to hear what transpired with the four of Yube. None of it must be heard outside. Do I make myself clear? Now I'm not just giving an instruction. I am issuing a decree. And I am issuing that decree with my manhood. Anybody that disobeys my decree will remain sterile. 
nor the children of that family will be sterile. Now I want to be left alone. God was allowed out to this grace and to destroy you for what you did to your brother in order to become humble 25 months ago. Your fall will be handed over to the new anointed by the chief priest when he returns. And he will tell the people the whole truth. You have lost your children like a young change you might think. That's not acceptable to me. It's not acceptable. The throne is mine. It must be handed over to my son upon my death. Not to any person, no matter who he is. I will not accept it. I will not accept it. Reveal to me. Show me the anointed one. Let me kill him. Let me kill him like an animal. Let me kill him like the animal. He is a dog. to the sea to acquire? Why? You who was made to understand, to believe that you are powerful and you are indestructible, how can you do? Everything, everything destroyed! 
Why do they have to do it now? Just when I need it! Just when I need it! This is infrantic Nikake! This is unacceptable! After what I did, I went to great lengths to assemble all that! In the next one hour, you will visit Adako. Hmm? Silence her permanently so that we know that that sight is done away with. Once that's done, you will ensure that the Chie will take over and the Chiozala do not return to Yube. Let them go from wherever they are. The governor has signed the execution warrant of Arinze, just like I wanted. I wired 500,000 Naira to the account of the prison officials, their head. He will be executed immediately they get the order. Everything is falling in place nicely. It remains finding Kelly and Kane. I want them dead too. I told you to stay back after the snacks boys. I will make sure that the story is told in such a way that nobody will ever suspect. You poisoned the snacks you sold to Joma at the prison gate. No, no, you ran away, almost rubbishing the entire operation. Now you're back here to my palace. My palace of all places. Why? I need more money, Your Majesty. What did you say? I paid you 500,000 Naira for that deal. I just realized the money is too small, Your Majesty. I need to leave this country for the US. And you will arrange that for me. You will also give me 15,000 US dollars. Or? I will tell the police and the public about what we did. Hmm. to blackmail your king. Oh, 
What is it? How dare you? How dare you ever think of such? You slut! How dare you? I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. Oh, I'm so mad. Oh, no, wait, 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 wait. I will show my face here. Now get up. I'm sorry, buddy. Get up! I'm sorry. Turn around! I'm sorry, buddy. Now start moving. Slowly. Slowly. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Have their day, and today is their day in Igube. How come you want to ask? Come in, come in, please. The blood of all the people you've killed have finally reached the ears of the Lady of Justice, and she has brought judgment to your household. Today, your highness, no one wins forever. No evil plan is ever foolproof, your majesty. Stanley, you me. Stanley, you lied to me. Why? Why? That's not the case, your majesty. All of us were lied to and betrayed by all these officers. Can't you see the cuffs in my hands? Look at Daniel too. We did not betray anybody. We only did what is expected of us when Osmond and Kelly came to us three days ago to tell us what has been happening here. The drama about Choma's death earlier today in our office was just an evidence gathering exercise. Choma! Choma! Come! And having gathered enough evidence, may I have the honor to tell you that you have the right to remain silent. Because anything you say again might be used against you in the court of law. Officer! Arrest him. Move it! Yeah! 
Loki and my brothers! Loki and my mother! Lord heaven's sake! The generation is cursed! Stop for the world now! No! Mama! Mia, you can go to the world! You can go to the world! From the gods and ancestors of the Hube Kingdom, take this. Take this. Who with truth and justice have delivered my message. Oh, yeah, she's